Surprise, mother <clears throat> Hi everyone, Kim Beato here. <clears throat> Got a really croaky voice. Um, <laughs> um, I've just had a nice bath and now I feel all nice and refreshed. And payday's coming. Payday! I love payday. <laughs> um, you're on the wire. Like, it's full on on the wire. But anyway, I love payday. Uh, we're, we're the type that ends up running out of money quite quickly. Because we'll, we'll get, like, all the stuff in for food and everything so that the fridge and freezer's always full. And then... <sighs> By the time like a week goes by, we'll have n nothing uh, quick and easy to do. We would have used all the quick and easy things where you don't have to cook. And I just love payday. Absolutely love it. Because we can actually, you know, get something that's right, really, really quick and easy. I love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed the Spyro video. <sighs> I know I enjoy doing it because I love the game. So, yeah. Uploading it and editing it was quite time consuming though. And, yeah, I might get some food tonight. Yeah, I'll just eat. Just eat! Yeah. I might get some food from there. That'd be nice. I like food. Yeah. Uh, just like this one over here. That. Watching. Hey, Family don't mind guy. the broken headphones. <laughs> Have you seen how bad these headphones are, though? Right, should hold them up and show them. Look at that. Hey, sell it, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> it's like properly broken um don't so ask broken. why because i can't remember what what did you do what well how did you break him again uh i can't remember neither can i um but yeah one minute they were all nice and uh proper headphones and then next minute they were broken and slanted and had to be taped <laughs> oh dear it's terrible for breaking stuff as well like breaks everything not not good you talking about me yeah I said you break everything oh I know including my phone I know <laughs> it's going to have to get to Tim in a minute <laughs> I'm joking with you Oh, Teddy's on bed. He's going to start my room. Me. He's going to come into the camera because he always likes being in camera. Don't you, Teddy? Don't you? You always come to Guinea Um, And, yeah, there's going to be a new Twin Flame video soon. Not tonight, Um, as it is quite late now. I just thought I'd do a little bit of a vlog while I feel all nice and refreshed before I do some steak because I really want steak and yeah I really want pop as well I really really like I get a craving for Dr Pepper and stuff and that's not even a pregnancy thing I had that before the pregnancy I always wanted pop <laughs> like a bottle of Dr Pepper always I love Dr Pepper it's my drink always the drink I get and unfortunately I can't get any energy drinks because I'm pregnant so I can't drink my monster I love monster the green one especially I can't have it so my most favorite drink is Dr Pepper thankfully I did used to have an addiction with the green monster energy drink and I had to stop drinking it completely for ages because I used to have two a day and they're really really bad for you it's just the taste I love the taste of it um but Dr Pepper is the one definitely that's not an energy drink it's just great I love it 
Um, my hair always looks a weird colour when it's wet. Has anyone noticed that? <laughs> um, what else? And as you all know, I want to progress with my meditations and stuff before I do another spiritual journey video because I've improved but not to the point where it's noticeable yet so I'm not going to do another video until it's noticeable yeah it might even be noticeable to you but it's not noticeable to me yet um I wonder what episode is watching a family guy I like family guy myself but I've watched that many I've lost count on how many family guys I've watched. And William's kicking. William's kicking. Oh, God, the time's getting shorter. We're going to have a baby boy soon. Oh, it's scary. It's awesome, but it's scary at the same time. It's like, I'm going to be a parent. I've always wanted to be a parent. I'm going to be a parent. I'm going to have a baby. It's going to be in front of me. He's not going to be in my belly. He's going to be in front of me. Yeah. <laughs> this is kind of what I look like on the inside. Like, ah! <sighs> I'm excited, but I'm also really nervous. Because I've never had a baby before. And I'll be great at it because I've always wanted a baby. And, yeah, I'm quite good... Um, I'm a quite good role model as well, so I think he's got that, which is good. I think that's something to look forward to, the fact I'm a good role model. And I'm a good influence. And I know an awful lot of shit. <laughs> About a lot of shit. So, it's not exactly going to be one with a parent that, that, that doesn't know anything. Thankfully. And Chris knows a lot of shit. And we kind of know a lot of shit together. Yeah. I like swearing, as you can probably tell. <sighs> I like the spiritual and everything. But I still like swearing. Um, some people think that spiritual people um, don't swear and don't um yell any at any time but it's not true spiritual people will probably swear more than non-spiritual people <laughs> just because i don't know i find it to be funny um i find certain words to be funny it makes me laugh um and yeah like certain names i find funny as well People have took me seriously in the past and I'm like, no, never take me seriously. I use it for fun. I use it for comedy. So if that, that's why my intros, surprise, motherfuckers. Uh, I just love that kind of thing. I think it's got like, um, I don't know, it just gives me a good vibe when I hear certain words and in a certain way. I don't know if any of you do, but... That's why I swear a lot, because I absolutely love it. And I'm not an angry person, so when I swear, it means I'm joking. <laughs> and people should not take me seriously when I'm swearing. And if I'm swearing in a negative way, then they've definitely done something wrong. <laughs> so I'm not exactly someone to get, you know, angry for nothing. It takes a lot to push my buttons. A lot. So when, when my pushings get... My pushings? <laughs> when my buttons get pushed, they have done something really bad. Yeah. Uh, I'm just trying to, you know, kind of let you get to know me a little bit more. Um, because I do do an awful lot of videos, so I think if I was my audience then I'd want to know more about the person I'm watching um, and as you can tell I'm a very rare breed I'm very different to anyone I know and 
and crackers. Absolutely crackers. I know a lot about a lot. I'm quite brainy. I love music. I love certain games. And yeah, I can be really, really funny as well at times. I've been told, and I kind of know that from experience because of the amount of people that have actually laughed a lot. And that I've just been just, I don't even have to try. I just end up like making people laugh out of the blue when I just try and you know, show them a sense of humour a bit and it makes people laugh a lot. And I'm very, very sarcastic. So now you you know a little bit more about me. Um and as you can tell, I am very, very spiritual. I like meditating, it makes me feel great. And I'm always trying to help everyone to find their higher self as well. And I don't like fakers. I hate fakers. That is the only time I will use the word hate. Fakers. Don't like them. Because there's, it's horrible. Why would anyone want to be someone else? Or why would anyone want to act so fake that it's blatantly obvious? It's like, you do know you're not fooling anyone. <laughs> um, but yeah. I think I'll leave this video where it is. And... I'll bid thee a farewell, so toodaloo motherfuckers, stay tuned.